You're listening to Soap Dirt, the latest in television entertainment news. Hey there, General Hospital fans. It's Soap Dirt on YouTube, and we have got your two-week spoilers running from Monday, July 3rd, all the way through Friday, July 14th on the ABC Soap Opera, and we are super excited to bring this to you. Before we dig in, if you haven't already, please click that subscribe button so you don't miss any of our General Hospital updates. And now we're going to dig in for the first week, the July 3rd through 7th episodes, we have got dated spoilers. And then the week of July 10th through 14th, we have undated spoilers that are still sizzling hot. All right, let's hop right in. Monday, July 3rd on GH, it's season 60, episode 202, and Gladys Corbin is very upset. No doubt because Sasha is pressing forward with trying to get her conservatorship, her guardianship thing lifted. But of course, Gladys can't let her do that because she needs her money to pay her illegal gambling debts. Can we just all agree Gladys is horrible and Sasha deserves so much better? And I'm really wondering, as fond of Sasha as Sunny is, is when this ugly truth comes out, what Sunny might do to Gladys? And I have to say, she's got it coming to her. Cody Bell has a meeting with Scott Baldwin that he's concerned about. This is about the Ice Princess, I believe, and that whole Leopold Taub thing. And Cody is lying about being related to Leopold. I don't know how he thought he would get away with this lawsuit when if they demand a DNA test, he's not going to be a match. So that's going to be interesting. Plus, Dante has a reason to be suspicious on Monday. And someone gives Drew Kane a gift. I wonder if that is Cyrus Renault because Drew is checking into prison and Cyrus has been waiting on him. Maybe he's going to give him a Bible or something since Cyrus has been trying to sell this stick that he has found the Lord behind bars when we know he's the same dog he always was. Plus, Sam McCall faces off with Carly Corinthos and they clear up the tension. It looks like it could have been a fight, but the ladies are very calm when discussing what has happened with Drew and Carly. Tuesday, July 4th, 2023, of course, is Independence Day. It is July 4th holiday and GH is running a rerun. It is the March 23rd, 2023, season six episode 138, which was a goodbye to Epiphany Johnson. So if you missed that episode or just really want to see it again, bring your tissues and tune in on July 4th. Wednesday, July 5th, 2023 is episode 203 of season 60 and Martin Gray gets a proposition, which should be interesting. And Cody has a crisis of conscience. He's been told by Selena Wu to work things out with Gladys, but he really, really wants to tell Sasha However, I think this crisis of conscience might be more about the fact that he is hiding his father-son relationship from Mac Scorpio. His dad is right there in town and he hasn't told him. And then Scott's going to tell him that pursuing this Leopold Taub lawsuit means that Cody's going to be investigated. So maybe Cody knows that he needs to drop this and maybe tell Mac the truth. Plus, Nina gets some news that makes her happy. Perhaps it is that Ned's memory is still not coming back. We'll have to wait and see. Felicia Scorpio does some investigating midweek. She is looking into Martin Gray's past because Lucy wants to know why he's so anti-marriage. And that investigation is what is going to bring Jack Montgomery, played by Walt Willie, in an All My Children crossover coming very soon. Also, Tracy Quartermain has a reason to call on Diane Miller. I don't know if she's going to want Diane to help Drew or what this is about, but I'm excited for it because Tracy and Diane in a scene together, heck yeah, more of that. Thursday, July 6th on GH is season 60, episode 204. And Terry Randolph is there to encourage Elizabeth Weber. It might be about the head nurse stuff, but I tend to think it's more about the dynamic going on with Liz and Finn right now, where Finn's daughter basically wants Liz there all the time. But Liz and Finn are, you know, not even in a relationship right now. But can little Violet Finn convince them to give things another shot? Molly Lansing 
has a big talk with her sister, Christina Corinthos, and she's going to unpack all of the angst over her infertility, endometriosis, and her lack of eggs. We are clearly leading up to a situation where Christina is going to volunteer to be her surrogate and probably to donate an egg as well. We also have Finn sharing some of his regrets. Maybe this is his regret over not fighting harder to stay with Liz to start with. And Brooklyn Quartermain issues a warning to someone, while Curtis and Marshall Ashford are there for TJ Ashford. And it looks like he's going to talk to them about some of his feelings about this infertility stuff as well. Friday, July 7th on General Hospital is episode 205 of season 60, and we have Anna Devane insistent about something. We have got Sunny reassuring Dante. We've got Liz catching up for a chat with Portia Robinson, and Sam checks in with Curtis. Maybe this is about the SEC thing, because as we know, Curtis is Drew's bestie, and Sam is Drew's baby mama, so they both have a vested interest in getting Drew out of jail as soon as they can, but it doesn't seem like there's anything to do since he has been sentenced and he pleaded guilty. Also, Tracy Quartermain refuses to accept when she is told no, and I have to wonder if it's Diane Miller that told her no, or if it's BLQ telling her no on doing any more spying. All right, before we dig into the second week of General Hospital, July 10th through 14th episodes, if you haven't, please click that subscribe button so you don't miss any of our General Hospital updates, and click a like if you're enjoying these spoilers. All right. The second week, the week of July 10th, someone is shot. That's kind of out of nowhere, right? Who is in a position to be shot by some gun-wielding maniac? Looking at the spoilers that we're dealing with, is this something from the people in Chechnya? I don't know. Is this something with Anna? Is this something with one of Dante's cases? Is this a mob thing? Is it a pikeman thing? I don't know. I mean, there is a lot of mob action in there, and we've also got Austin, who's being forced to do surgeries on people that get shot, so this could tie back to him. Kind of vague, but also very interesting. It's July sweeps this month. If you didn't know that, they're doing special sweeps right now, and all the soaps are ramping up with these big storylines, so a shooting is definitely in line with amping up the drama for sweeps. We also have Jocelyn Jacks confronting Esme Prince. I don't know if this is about Esme getting friendlier with Spencer or just in general, but you know, Joss, she is definitely Carly's daughter and she will go confront anyone that she feels like. Plus, Chase arrests someone. Maybe it's the person who did the shooting. We will have to see. There's a lot to unpack these two weeks on General Hospital. And don't forget, Tuesday, July 4th on Independence Day, it is a rerun. Thank you for being a loyal listener. Follow us wherever you get your podcast because you don't want to miss the next episode. Soap Dirt is on all the major podcast platforms, including Apple Podcast, Spotify, iHeartRadio, and more. 